guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Friday, May 28th, 2021. And I am coming on here to give you guys a wings update video for May. I think this is the third one. We should have one more and that'll be coming out next week. Um, so I just wanted to come on here and give you guys an update. Um, my name is Rose. I like to crochet for those of you who are new. I also like yarn a lot and I like to make stitch markers. So go check out my Etsy shop. Oh, I also have merchandise. By the way, you guys, it's like 50 degrees here in Chicago today. So, um, and we were in the eighties last week, so I'm really cold. So I have on my shut the front door hoodie and you can get this on my Teespring shop. The link is underneath the video. Um, uh, my daughter designed this. So, um, I am here in the Chicago area and I have one one daughter her nickname is carrots and we have quite a few animals so we call this place the zoo so anyway um, wings is a domestic violence organization that is based here in the Chicagoland area and this year and last year, you guys, along with me, did charitable uh, donations to this organization. Um, what we did is we crocheted all kinds of things and then we donated it to them. So um, if you need more information about Wings, everything will be in the description box down below. And I also wanted to give you guys an update on the items of the month. So for the month of June, we are going to be donating shawls and the my contact over there said lightweight shawls. So um, if you are planning on donating a shawl, I would recommend a lightweight yarn and um, maybe not a real heavy pattern or something really tight. So nice and loose and airy. Um, the other thing that we updated is for October, when you guys send in your washcloths for wings, you can also send in dishcloths scrubbies like the kitchen scrubbies you can send in like the the towels that like you can crochet the top so like a towel I don't know what to call it Pamela from Pamela's Adoring Crochet is doing like a year-long make-along thing so go check her out I'll link her down below too anyway they don't want actually crocheted towels but you can do the towels that you crochet the topper you guys know what i'm talking about <laughs> you can send those in for october um you can also send in those shower poofs anyway you can send those in too so also as a reminder those items please don't send them in until october they don't want them until october so um i do have some um, packages today that have washcloths in them and I think there was a misunderstanding with some of the other YouTube channels I don't want washcloths now um, we have other items of the month that are going on before October so please if you can don't send me anything for October before October okay all right for this video I have 21 donations and for this month the donated items that they requested were diaper bags so are you guys ready to get started okay so I have a couple small packages and then a lot of big packages but hopefully we'll get through this quickly and I think someone sent in some boxes of stuff for donations for you guys because you guys know that we do thank you gifts um, after every month um, just as our way of saying thank you for donating anyone who donates gets entered and uh, some of the prizes include some stitch markers from that were made by me but donated by other people a project bag makeup bags that were hand sewn um, I have a goodie box and in the goodie box is a thumb drive with <clears throat> all of crystal from bag o days patterns on them um and there's a couple other really cool prizes so i guess they're not prizes they're thank you gifts okay are you guys ready to get started all right this first package came from joy bell malcolm and she's from florida and she sent me a note and the note says hello rose my name is joy bell malcolm and i love to crochet me too me too i do too she says please accept these wash rags for your wings project respectfully uh joy bell that is such a pretty name she says p.s pamela sent me okay so she did send some washcloths and here they are there's like a little mini one and a bunch of regular size ones and joy bell thank you so much um again as a reminder guys if you can please hold off on sending the washcloths until october that would be awesome but these are really really gorgeous just look at the design on that one joy bell you did an amazing job thank you very very much okay 
Next. Okay, you guys, this next package actually came all the way from Switzerland. Can you believe that? Holy smackerel, shut the front door. Shut the front door, you guys. Seriously, Switzerland. <laughs> Okay, so we got, this is from Nadja. She is from Switzerland and she sent me a postcard and I'm gonna have to put my glasses on to read this, you guys. Okay, she says, Dear Rose, Carrots, and the Zoo, I had to make more after everything went so smoothly with shipping the last time. She sent some headbands and scrunchies um, for April, I think it was. She says, I made some diaper clutches that can be put in a handbag or a backpack. I really hope they are of use. Sadly, I didn't have enough yarn in matching colors for a real diaper bag. I'm already working on some shawls, so the next package should be on its way soon. With love, Naja and her zoo, Lexi and Bean. Oh my gosh, I want to meet Lexi and Bean. Okay, so she also included a note so we would know what the pattern is. It says pattern on Ravelry is called the Easy Diaper and Wipes Case by Kama Von Lama. <laughs> I love that. She says she mostly followed the pattern for the white one and then made the others following the general idea. One is moss stitch, the other is the lemon peel stitch, I think. The yarn is white, Bernat Handicrafter prints, and the blue and pink are Lily Sugar and Cream Ombres. Okay, so you guys check these out. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous. So these are the ones that have like the two pockets. Here, I'll show you guys. So one pocket is for the diapers, like one or two diapers, and the other pocket is for a little portable thing of wipes. Oh my gosh, they're just beautiful. So there's one, there's two. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Look at this. And there's three. Oh my God, Nadja, you did such a beautiful job on these. I just love them. And I can't believe you sent them all the way from Switzerland. You rock. Okay, oh my gosh, thank you so, so much. Um, also, if you guys, um, if you can't donate something, please don't worry about it. And you don't have to make a comment that says, I'm sorry, I can't donate. It's okay, it really is. If you can donate locally, please donate locally. That would be even better because then you don't have to pay for shipping and someone in your area will benefit from this too. Um, the other thing is, if you could just leave a comment on anything that you see here today, um, just encouraging everyone who does send in um, that their work is amazing. Because I think a lot of people don't think that their work is very good. And I think everyone does an, an, a phenomenal job. So thank you so, so much, Naja, for sending these. Okay, next. Okay, so these next two packages came from the same person. This is from Amanda Burnett, and she is from Kansas. And she did send me a note, and the note says, Hello, Rose. I ran across YouTube videos from Pamela's Adoring Crochet and Cinnamon Stitches that you were needing dishcloths and washcloths for the Wings organization. I added dish towels, doilies, and coasters. I hope that was okay. I enjoy crocheting and had so many that I wanted to help out Wings by donating these items. I have sent two yellow envelopes. Okay, well, we got both the envelopes, so thank you so much, Amanda. All right, so she has them packaged really nicely in the bag, so I'm not gonna take them out, but I'm gonna show you 100% cotton dish towel, and this is 100% cotton hand towel. Oh, look at how pretty that is. Oh my gosh. Okay, now this is what I was talking about, you guys. This is the towel with the crocheted topper. So you can send these in for October, and it looks like she has two of them in there. And then she's got 100% cotton dishcloths and washcloths, and it looks like there's three or four in there. And then, oh my gosh, these are so cute. These can be used as little washcloths too, doilies or coasters. You know, we're gonna leave it up to the people at Wings for what they're gonna use them for. Okay, this one says 100% cotton dishcloths and washcloths. So there's that, and then there's another bag. Also 100% cotton dishcloths and washcloths. So I'm gonna leave these in the bag for wings so that then they know exactly what it is. So wow, Amanda, thank you so much for sending all of those kitchen items. Um, if everyone else can just wait until October to send them, that would be 
awesome. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, next. Okay, so this is the last of like the little bags. I think there's still in a couple little boxes. So this is from Kay and she is from Michigan. And she also sent me a note and the note says, Hello, Rose. I have made six washcloths and one hand towel for wings. You are such a wonderful person for all that you do. You guys, I'm just open up, opening up boxes. Seriously, it's okay. I just started to follow you and I am here to stay. Woohoo! I am just learning how to crochet. Oh, you're doing a fantastic job. Wait till you see this, you guys. And I am looking forward to sending you more for wings. Sending you good vibes from Michigan. Stay safe from K. Haha, <laughs> K. This is awesome. Okay, you guys have to see how this is packaged. I don't want to take them out either because they look so pretty. So she's got like all these washcloths and she's got them like tied up so pretty. And then she's got like a shower poof back there. And it says one hand towel, six washcloths, one baby washcloth, and one loofah. Oh my gosh, absolutely adorable. I love the way you packaged it. I love the colors. And for a beginner crocheter, you're doing an amazing job. And thank you so, so much for donating to Wings. It's, it's amazing how everyone has come together to help out people they don't even know. It's great. Okay, next. So the next couple packages came from Amazon, and so there was no return address on them or anything, so they came just like that. Um, but I have three here that did have those little gift receipts in there, so I know who they're from. So this first one, it says... A gift for you. Thank you for all who are donating to Wings from Deborah Fremond. Okay, so she sent, okay, so this is the diaper bag that Deb sent from Amazon. And it just says it is a French bowl diaper bag. So there is the bag that Deb sent. So thank you so much, Deb. Okay, the next one also came from Amazon. And the note in there says, Enjoy your gift from four wings from Gloria S from Florida. So this is the one that Gloria sent. And we've had a couple of these donated. It's like a backpack diaper bag and it's adorable. And the last one that came in a big bag like this from Amazon. Let me see if I can find this. Hi Rose, this is for wings. I keep hoping to win one of Crystal's thumb drives from Lucy Stamp. All right, Lucy. So here is the bag that Lucy sent from Amazon. And it's so nice. I love it. So Lucy, thank you so, so much for donating to wings. That's awesome. Okay, and then I have this little box right here. And this is from creations by Jax. So if you guys don't know Jax, you should know her. Um, she is awesome. Like I, something about her personality, like we could be sisters, I'm just saying. And she likes the color purple, so you can't go wrong. She sent me a card, says Rose for Wings, and she even put a little butterfly on the back. And let's see, it says she's giving me a paper hug. Oh, Jax, ooh. Okay, and she says, hi Rose, here is my diaper bag, quote unquote, and a few little treats inside for wings. There was no pattern, and she says, I love you. Oh, I love you too, Jax. Jaxy poo, right? Isn't that what they call you? <laughs> okay, oh my God, you guys, this is awesome. Okay, let me get these off of here. Hang on a second. Okay, you guys, this is an awesome diaper bag. Wow, check it out. It's huge. Oh my gosh, I just love it. And look at the little flower. And it's actually really soft. Oh my gosh, that is such a beautiful bag, Jax. No pattern, guys, okay? And then she also sent this, which is like a portable wipes holder. And she even sent a changing pad. Oh my gosh, Jax, that is so sweet of you. Thank you so, so much for donating to Wings. I appreciate it. And everyone at Wings appreciates it too. Okay, next. So this next box comes from Leilani Hamilton and she is from Texas. Hi, Leilani. And she did not leave a note, but that's okay. You guys remember, you don't ever have to put a card in the box or a note. If you just write Wings on the front, I'll know that it's not for me. <laughs> Okay, wow, this is so cool. So she made three bags and it's all with that um, really soft, like fluffy blanket yarn. Look at that, you guys, with the button on it. Oh my gosh, I love that. 
And then here is another one. Wow, these handles are awesome too. So here is another one. Oh man, I love these. Oh, and this one's even better. Oh my gosh, I love the button on that one. Wow, Leilani, you did a fantastic job. But Leilani, thank you so much for the three diaper bags. They are absolutely beautiful. We love them. Okay, next. Okay, so this next box comes from Kelly Sutherland and she is from Wisconsin. Hi, neighbor. <laughs> she sent me a card and, oh, the card says, hold on a second. She says, hi, Rose. I dusted off my sewing machine to create a few diaper bags for wings. No patterns, just winged it. <laughs> the crocheted one is also just my pattern. I didn't um, line it, but it did, but it did make a pouch to hold smaller items that may fall through the stitches. The yellow one has a burp cloth bib and a blanket inside. Thanks for all you do from Kelly. Oh my gosh. Okay. So here is, wow, you sewed these. Okay. So this is awesome. I love the material because it feels like it's like a canvasy type. And there is the, um, whatever that thing was that she said was in there. <laughs> oh my gosh. And there's pockets on both sides. So that is awesome. Oh my gosh. And here is the crocheted one. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. Wow. Kelly, I know you said no pattern. It's just great. And it's like sparkle yarn. It's sparkly. Can you go wrong with sparkly? Okay, and here's the little pouch that she sewed for inside so nothing falls through. So it's pretty much lined, right? Oh my gosh, I love it. That's gorgeous. Okay, and here is the other one. Oh my gosh, you guys see this? I just love it. Look at that. There's a baby block on it. Okay, oh, and it's like a Velcro closure. And then there are all the extra items inside there. Oh my gosh, Kelly, you did an amazing job. I'm quite jealous that you busted out your sewing machine and you actually accomplished this because I could never, ever do that. <laughs> okay, so Kelly, thank you so much. We really appreciate it. All right, next. All right, you guys, this next box comes from, oh, it says Mountain Crafts. 5280 from Colorado. Okay, so let's see what's in here. We've got some cards. Oh, it says hi. <laughs> and it says four rows. And oh, it's got balloons on it. How cute. Okay, so it says, Rose, I learned about you and your support for wings through Cinnamon Stitches. You guys know Cinnamon Stitches. She's awesome. In the box are washcloths for your October drive. All the best. Um, S Cyn Cynthia, Cynthia, Erica, I cannot read what your name is. So if you are the one who donated this, can you please leave a comment down below um, and let me know what your name is. There's also another card in here. Oh, you're so sweet. It says, thank you. Thank you for being you know that you have a lot of talents and gifts you can offer the world. Little by little, things will improve. Remember who you are and dust off some of those dreams. All the best as you find a positive way forward. Okay, that's beautiful. Okay, so she put in three books in the box. Um, Murder on the, oh, an Agatha Christie book, The Girl on the Train, and Into the Water. So, Whoever this is, can you please let me know if I can donate these books to Wings? I would appreciate it. And then she sent, oh my goodness, she sent a little teddy bear. Oh my gosh, some little one is going to love this at Wings. Seriously, how adorable. Is it a teddy bear or a dog? I can't tell, but it's adorable. Okay, and then there's another package that's wrapped. And I think these are the washcloths. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Okay, so they're all like these circle ones, you guys. Oh, look at that, that's just gorgeous. There's another one. And then there's like small ones to match them. So Mountain Crafts, thank you so, so much for sending this box of goodies. Um, please leave a comment down below and let us know what your first name is so we can all say thank you very much and let me know about the books if I can donate those to Wings. All right, you guys, this next box is from Rosalie Wright and she is from Pennsylvania. Hi, Rosalie. So there's no note in the, ba in the box, but look at you guys what she sent. Okay, so she's got... Uh, a diaper bag here 
and a shawl. So here is the diaper bag. It's humongous and absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And in the bag, there is like a changing pad in here or like a little mini blanket. Look at this, you guys. It matches. Oh my God, this is absolutely gorgeous. Rosalie, you did such a good job on this. Any mom is gonna be really, really happy to have this, especially this, cause you know, putting your baby's butt on something to change them. Yeah, this is a much better option. So, wow, this bag is phenomenal. In case you guys wanna see it again, yes. Wow, Rosalie, it's gorgeous. Okay, and then she sent a shawl and you guys, Wow, it's beautiful. Okay, so let me see if I can show you guys that here. Let me move the bag here. All right, here is the shawl. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's like, it's got the black on the top. Look at this, you guys. It's gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Rosalie, thank you so much for donating a shawl and a diaper bag for Wings. It, they're, they're just phenomenal. You do great work and I really, really appreciate it. Rosalie, thank you so much. Your work is amazing. Okay, next. All right, so this next huge box comes from Barb and she is from Gahana, Ohio. And Barb sent me a card and the card says, Rose, I'm so thankful that Crystal from Bag o Day shared what you do for wings. Keep up the fantastic work. From one Yarny sister to another, have a blessed Barb. And then she has a note for you guys. To those that donate items, you are so talented and generous with your time. Keep up the amazing work that you do. So let me show you what Barb sent. She sent a diaper bag. Oh my God. Oh, it's not a diaper bag. It's a backpack, but that's okay because it's so cute. You could definitely use that as a diaper bag. So Barb, thank you so much for donating the backpack. It is awesome. Okay, next. All right, you guys. So this next box came from Amazon and it just came today and there was no thank you card in the box. So I don't know who it's from. Like usually they have those little square notes that say who it's from. So this is the bag that got donated. So whoever sent this, thank you so much. Um, if you want to remain anonymous, you're more than welcome to do that. But if you know that this was sent from you, I just need an email with the tracking number and that way I can write your name down on my list for to be eligible to win one of the thank you prizes at the end of the month. So whoever sent this, thank you so, so much. Okay, next. All right, so this next box comes from Amy and she is from Minnesota. Hi, Amy. She left me a note and she says, hello, Rose, here are two diaper bags I made. I used acrylic yarn and a strand of cotton thread to give it some strength. The bottom has a piece of plastic canvas between the color and the black. I just made up my own pattern for them. They were fun to make from Amy Kuhn. Oh my gosh. You guys, wait till you see these. Okay, so they were kind of squished in there. All right, oh my gosh, these are absolutely incredible. So here is one of them and it's got the pockets on the front. There's no pockets on the back, but I'll show you the handles. So there's that, oh my gosh, it's awesome. And then you can't really see the plastic canvas because it's, it's sewn. The bottom is black, which makes sense. And then the inside is just all pink. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Amy, this is gorgeous. Okay, and then there's a blue one. Oh my gosh, you've got all your bases covered. Okay, so here is the blue one. How freaking cool is that? Amy, these are gorgeous. I just love them. There's the black bottom and it's got the plastic canvas in there and there's no pockets on the back. Oh my gosh, they're absolutely gorgeous. I just love them. Amy, you are so talented and I'm just a tiny bit jealous. <laughs> okay, next. You guys, this next box comes from one of my favorite people on YouTube. Her name is Jane and you guys know her as Scraptastic Yarns. What's up, Jane? Oh my God, I'm so excited she sent me a box. All right, she sent this card 
and she writes, hi Rose, I'm afraid these are going to need to be pressed after being manhandled into the box. Much love and hugs from James Graptastic Yarns. Okay, so you guys should definitely be um, subscribed to Jane because she's phenomenal and her channel is called Scraptastic. I mean, seriously, does it get any better than that? And she actually put a call out for people to send uh, sewn diaper bags um, because I guess people think that all they can do is crochet to donate to wings, but you guys can crochet, loom knit, regular knit, sew. It depends on what the item is. All right, so let's look at these bags. I'll make sure that they're in nice condition before <laughs> Wings gets them. She also showed these on her channel too before she sent them. So, oh my gosh, they're beautiful. So here's one of them. And look at the fabric, you guys. It is just gorgeous. Oh my gosh. And then there's a pocket in the front. Holy smackerels. Oh my gosh. Jane, you're my hero. <laughs> Here is another one. Now this one also has this adorable flowers on the back and this one has pink on the front. And then look at the pocket on that one. It's gray. Oh, you guys, there's handles for all of these. See that? They're just tucked in. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Okay, now these look like they're more for um, like darker colors. So here is the back of the bag. There is the front flap and there is the pocket. And here is the last one, same fabric on the back. Oh my gosh, these are just amazing, Jane. Here is the front flap and the front pocket. Oh my gosh, wow. Like, I need one of these for myself in purple. Wink, wink, hint, hint. <laughs> I'm kidding. If you make any more like this, let me know, because I would love to buy one of these from you, as I'm sure a lot of people would. So, Jane, thank you so, so much for sending in these gorgeous diaper bags. They are incredible. Okay, next. All right, you guys, this next box is from Anonymous Amy, and she is from Kentucky. What's up, Amy? And she sent me a card in a purple envelope and there is the card and it says thank you so much for the nice things you do for your thoughtfulness too for just being you okay hello I can read this one because her print is bigger <laughs> hello Rose here are a few diaper bags for wings they're not crochet I couldn't find any tutorials for a diaper bag I never realized there aren't any Anyway, I used some fabric I had and a sewing tutorial for a tote bag by Debbie Shore. I altered the pattern to make it a diaper bag. I hope that they bring some kind of hope to the recipients. Many thanks for allowing us to help. Your yarny friend, Anonymous Amy. Okay, so, oh my gosh. This is awesome. Like I said, I'm so jealous of anyone who can actually thread a needle on a sewing machine because that's one of my problems. <laughs> Okay, so here's one of them. This is awesome. So this is actually stretchy material, so you can stuff this thing to the gills, and there's pockets on the back too, and that's also stretchy. And then, oh my gosh, it's got a zipper. <gasps> okay, you guys, wow. I'm lucky I can zip up my coat without breaking a zipper. So let me see <laughs> what it looks like on the inside. Oh my gosh. And there's a zippered pocket on the inside too. Here, let me see if I can show you at least one of them. Oh my gosh, Amy, these are gorgeous. Okay, here's another one. Absolutely adorable. Little giraffes. Oh my God, could these be any cuter? Here's one with bunnies and bears and foxes. Oh my gosh. Amy, you're so talented. You got to sell these. <laughs> All right, here's another one. So adorable. And here is the last one. And just too much. These are absolutely phenomenal. Wow. Amy, I love them. They're great. And I cannot wait to donate these to Wings for you. All right, next. All right, you guys. So the next package is a box and an actual package package and they both came from the same person and I only know that because I just looked at the cards and it says enjoy your gift from Gina Ingram and that's one of them and then the other gift note says Rose find enclosed four diaper bags for those at wings praying these will bless those in need from Gina Ingram so there I don't think there was four in there 
The ticket only said one, so I hope that that's okay. Um, and she did send, oh my gosh, you guys can see the print on there. It's the little Target dog. So there's one of the bags. And then here's another one. I don't want to take them out of the plastic, you guys. I have a dog and he sheds. There's one with butterflies. So Gina, they are absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much for thinking of donating to Wings. Okay, we have two more boxes, guys. All right, you guys, this next humongous box comes from Diana DeForest from Florida. And it says Wings, May and June. And she did send a card. There is the card. You're so kind. Oh, you guys are the best. All right, it says, Hi, Rose, Carrots, and the Zoo. Finally getting May and June to you. Diaper bag is from Mary Maxim called the Flower Bed Diaper Bag. I did have to adapt it. Hopefully someone will get good use out of it. Okay, so let me show you that before I keep reading. Wow, this, oh, this has the plastic canvas in the sides so the sides don't collapse. Oh, and there's plastic canvas in the bottom. Oh my gosh, look at this, you guys. So it's got like the tote handles. It's button and it's got plastic canvas sewn into the sides and the bottom so it stands up. Wow, that is so cool. I just love this, Diana. It's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna have to go check out that pattern, seriously. Okay, and then she says the shawl is called Lizard by Jasmine Rassinen on Ravelry. Made with shawl in a ball, I thought it kind of looked like a wing. Hopefully someone will feel the love and prayers of all these busy hands making gifts. Oh, you, you guys, you know that they do, right? Okay, so let me show you the shawl. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my goodness, look at this, you guys. Oh, yes, this is exactly what they want, you guys. That's beautiful. That's absolutely beautiful. Diana, did you just use one, one cake, one shawl in a ball? It's beautiful. Amazing work, amazing work. I'm gonna put it back in the baggie if that's okay. <laughs> All right, you guys, one more box. Here are the packages that came from Doris Wright. Hi, Doris. She is from Pennsylvania. Hold on, let me just make sure because the tag is really small. She is from Pennsylvania. Hi, Doris. And she told me she was going to be sending some of this stuff. So she sent this little bag and she sent a box that was completely overstuffed. <laughs> and in this bag was a package of icy yarns. And on the top it says, Dear Rose, I received these as a happy mail. If you like, please keep for yourself, or if not, gift it to someone who donates to Wings. This is from Doris Wright. She is, um, I don't think she has a channel, but I know she's definitely on Instagram. It's Rose Cottage Studio. So I will make sure that I link her if I can find, I think she does have a YouTube, but I don't know if there's any videos on there. So if I can find her, I'll link her. And so we will see what happens with this. I need to do a little bit more research on if I like it or not. <laughs> and then this huge box, you guys, was so stuffed. And she even writes on here, Rose, please use as a monthly gift to a donator. Oh my gosh. Okay, I already have a lot for May, so I'm probably not gonna use this until like maybe June. Um, but I'm, I'm not gonna take it all out. Well, maybe I will. Is it all the same? Oh my gosh. Hold on, you guys. So it looks like it's all the same. It's Red Heart Super Saver Ombre, and the color is... Uh, anthracite and it looks like this entire box <clears throat> is completely stuffed with this yarn so that is so awesome Doris thank you so much for sending all of this yarn for giveaways I will keep you guys posted this will most likely be um, given away as a thank you prize in June so awesome thank you so much Doris all right, you guys, here's the last box and it was from Amazon and there was a note in the box and it says, hi Rose, just a few diaper bags for wings. I'm afraid trying to crochet one would take way too long. Thanks for doing this from Brenda Rogers. <laughs> Brenda, I know your thoughts, man. She sent two diaper bags and they're adorable. There you go, you guys. 
Brenda, thank you so much for offering to send these from Amazon. We appreciate it and Wings appreciates it. Okay, that's it, you guys. I will have one more Wings update and at that time we will announce who the gift recipients are for May. Remember, June is shawls. The rest of the list is down below in the description box. If you could please leave a comment and just thank everyone for all of their hard work and for spending their money if they sent a bag from Amazon. It's just as important that we thank them as well. Remember, please don't send washcloths until October. I really appreciate it. All right, guys, take care. See you later. Bye.